right, I'm back. This is like part 10 of Quest to Complete Minecraft, which I honestly never thought would happen, or let alone in a voiceover. So let's get started. And we are in Minecraft. Let's go. But let's go where? I don't know. Maybe I should sleep first. Oh, it's morning time. Now, before this video, I set out to have a game plan. So over the past month, I have gained knowledge of a duplication glitch, which I have used for a few weeks, and it's really, 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 really good. Um, I haven't used it on this world, I've used it on other survival worlds, on, on console edition, and it works pretty well. When I say pretty well, I mean it works great. It's so good though. So I'm going to leave a link in the description for a video to show you how to do it, and it's very, very simple. And I'll kind of give a brief overview of it in this video. So, uh, yeah. Now to get started with the duplication glitch, I just have to get all my, you know, my most prized valuables. And I guess just general stuff I'll need to do because it'll probably be useful. So after a brief battle with the skeletons, which to be honest, I don't really know why I was doing it anyway. I was going to carry on gathering my valuables, but first I needed a chest for the dupe glitch. So I spent a while getting all the items I needed. This is just a little speed. This is just it all sped up, to be honest. So, so yeah. But in the end, we managed to get it all sorted out in one chest. But to make sure the dupe works, I had to exit the game and turn it offline and then join back on. So the first try was a fail, but the second try was a success. So just watch everything I do in this video. What you do is you go into the pause menu, then you completely quit the game. And then you load back on, go back into the world, and then it should be completely duplicated like that. Again, there is a way better tutorial in the description, just watch it. Yeah. And then I carried on doing the glitch about four more times, which I'm just going to show you all the sped up footage. Just to show you how long it took and how long it took to film that one freaking video yeah took me a while didn't it yeah you might want to skip this part because i'm just going to start ranting about how long it took <sighs> yeah look at it look how much time that is 15 minutes actually that's probably a lot longer than 15 minutes to be honest but but yeah and then after ages, I managed to get it done. With that, I decided to upgrade my tools with more iron tools. <sighs> and then I eventually managed to upgrade all of my armor back to better iron armor. And then went to bed. <sighs> it's morning time. But sadly, I had to pair my specs to the dead dog. I mean, not sad that I did it. I mean, sad that he died. No, no, no. One of these days, I'm going to get that nether portal done, I swear. Right, horses, your time to shine. But first, I had to make a wheat farm for some reason. And then I decided to get some bone meal for some... I don't really know why I was doing all this, to be honest. I just wanted to go out on my horse. Wait. Yeah, that didn't sound wrong, did it? Because I'm going to be honest. When you're with your friends at school, um, that let's just say it's hard not to get your mind wrapped around things that you would regret saying. If that makes sense, and if it doesn't, I'm sure you wouldn't want to hear it hey but at least the wheat farm's done right to be honest i literally made all that wheat just to feed my horse but horses in minecraft don't even eat wheat so like yeah i'm that stupid aren't i all right now i could finally set off on my horse journey okay one thing i forgot about was bridges because you know your horse can't swim in like two block deep water but the thing is i was stupid in this clip because the literal freaking height of the water is one block so yeah and then after catching up to my freaking horse it was running away every second i got to build a bridge i managed to get him across a three block bridge <sighs> and then after a little while we got to a sand biome and i was really hoping to find a sand temple or whatever it's called but i didn't end up finding one just my luck i just had to point out how slow the horse swims in water so if you ever see me run the horse through a bit of water it's not as fast as it looks just one thing it's my birthday today well it's actually on tuesday but we're celebrating everything today because it's the weekend and it's really fun i got my presents and everything i got so many cool things and yeah i just want to show you a few clips real quick tactical nuke incoming oh my god look at these bag of heroes Anyway, back to horse riding. I am freaking hating this water stuff because I keep having to build bridges, man. And so I did. 
and I managed to get my holes across. Finally, I found a mesa biome. Like, that's what I think it's called. Right, now this is a big issue for me because I'll have to build a freaking bridge. But after ages of mining and then building and using sand blocks till it falls to the bottom, I managed to get my horse across. And we arrived at our next stop, Mob Island, but we managed to get off there real quick. I was even just riding my horse down a hill and then a freaking zombie with full gold armor came ramming into my horse's face. All right, horsey, stay here. So then I got to building the bridge and finished it for me and the horse. And this Enderman. Hey, get out of the road, buddy. And then I got shot going in between two skeletons. Here's the horse swimming again. Oh, let's just get away from that creeper real quick. Let's just go around all the mobs. Now let's get down the hill. All right, just traveling. Hey, freaking skeleton, why are you killing my horse? Why are you trying to kill my horse, man? What's with these racist skeletons just hitting him because he's brown, man? <sighs> Painful swimming again. Oh, we've been traveling forever. Where are we even going? Thought there's going to be a woodland mansion over there. Oh my God, there is. And there is also a little lake. Back to bridging. And see, that was surprisingly easy. All right, but first I had to look for my horse. Wait, where did he go? Horsey? Horsey, where did you go? Horsey, where are you? Oh, there you are. Come here, horsey. Ow, freaking skeleton. Come on, let's get out of here. All right. Oh, no, please don't tell me how to build another bridge. No. Gwen, I'm just going to show you how long it took the bridge, including killing multiple mobs. And I was building the city out of sand, so it just kind of all sunk to the bottom. There was a creeper exploding and everything, but eventually we managed to get the horse cross. And it was all by me. Oh, come on, you could do it. Let's go. Wait a second. I've been to this woodland mansion before. Yes, that's correct. If you look back earlier in the video, you could literally see that I already explored it, and I completely forgot about it. What a waste of time. I set out looking for a village or, or some kind of great massive fortress or temple or some naturally generating spawning thing that I might be able to get some loot from. And instead, I'm going back to woodland mansions I've already been to and just making it more dramatic by going along the edge of the map, taking it longer. <sighs> well, I can't be sad because today's my birthday. Well, it's on Tuesday, but we're celebrating it today because it's the weekend. Let's go! When I said let's go, I meant let's go. I literally went and explored everywhere around the Woodland Mansion for some reason, because I was bored. And then I had to build, which I really thought would be my last bridge, but as you can guess, it wasn't. And then I spent ages trying to find my way home, which of course I didn't, and then I had to build another bridge. But this also wasn't my last one. And then we spent ages looking around, going through different biomes, trying to get home. And just when I thought we got home, I didn't. It just had a similar landscape. And then after looking around the area, trying to look for any signs of my house, I decided to go through a little forest, trying to find my way back. And it took a while until I actually saw my house just from over the mountain. I could have got the when pigs fly achievement and i'm surprised i didn't get when the horses fly achievement after doing that jump but yeah and then after a painstakingly long time i had to build one more freaking bridge to get to my house this was my last one and then after all that we were back home so when i got back i set up my horse and went up the ladder and then this was the end of part 10 of quest to complete minecraft